in the sun, it is resting on one of its base edge on HP. The triangular phase opposite to the resting edge is parallel to HP and perpendicular to VP, and apex is towards the observer. Now, first we will see that it is resting on its base edge on HP. So, first we will draw square in top view. First, we draw front to top of a square pyramid. And left side, it is resting on one of its base edge. Now, we are talking about the triangular phase opposite to the resting edge. Now, here let's say if this is the resting edge, then the, this is the triangular phase which is opposite to the resting edge, right? If this is the resting edge, right, B dash, C dash, then this is, this is the phase which is opposite to the resting edge. See, this is the resting edge, this is the triangular phase. So, this is that phase which is opposite to the resting edge. Now, they are saying that this phase is parallel to HP. So, that means this A dash, D dash, O dash, they want parallel to X parallel. So, I can draw this directly, but the only problem is when I will draw, there is no guarantee that this will be on X parallel. So what we will do, we will draw perpendicular from here. We will rotate our drafter. Let's say this is your drafter. So then we will align this line with this. See this way. We will align this way and we will draw perpendicular. We will draw perpendicular from here. This will be P dash. Then we will draw, we will mark point over here. This is P dash, C dash. This is P dash. See, we will take this and we will cut here. Then we will draw horizontal line. Then we will take P dash to O dash, cut here. And P dash to A dash, D dash, and cut here. Right? So we have drawn. The triangular phase now it is parallel to horizontal plane. It's parallel to x y. After that, we project a dash b dash from here, a and d from here. So we get d a. Same thing, o dash from here and b dash c dash from here. We'll extend b from here and c from here. And this is o. So same, an observer will see from the top. Extreme boundary would be dark. OA would be dark, OD would be dark, and this B dash, C dash would be dotted because when you see from the top, it is away from you. We will mark point M dash, this is axis, project M down, this is N, so we will get axis in top view also. Right? So this is the triangular phase which is parallel to HP and more or less it is perpendicular to vertical plane also. But now we have to draw apex towards the observer. Where is apex? Apex is over here. Right? So now we have to do this parallel, this surface. Triangular phase is already parallel to horizontal plane. Right? Now we need to draw this triangular phase perpendicular to vertical plane and apex is towards the observer. So what we will do, we will rotate this diagram 90 degree clockwise. So that means we will draw this again. See, draw line, take AD, cut here, cut AD. It's dark.
Stava il presente. E mi fa mi ha questo bilash e dash si dash di dash o dash now observe and see from here so o is nearer to him first we will draw boundary line it will be dark and line passing through o will be dark why because it is nearer to the observer and axis So if you see this, and this is your vertical plane, this is your horizontal plane. So this is the triangular phase which they were talking about. See this. When you see from the front, you see just a line. So this is the object. And this is the surface which is parallel to horizontal plane. It is perpendicular to vertical plane, right? And apex is towards the observer. 